too much. I drove all the way to Yagaba and I could see that the rice fields are very green after yesterday's uh, rain and we are praying that we get a good harvest. Angelo can be sabeni so you go again tank ma a chen yaba obole an chen chen la wonyama tatina mena marakuli ne ate namba mena tetuborla ajiri nan nan yini this election is about honesty and dishonesty there are two kinds of people there are those who want political power for themselves and there are those who want political power to use it to improve the lives of their people I'm voting that it is and you vote la that are no bura buye bubu nyiwa bayaka paramo I'm a man rubika budindila bayaka paramo papa ma budget and so those who want power for themselves they say that if even you've heard it before if even you sell your mother you should sell her and get political power and that when you get political power you can go and buy your mother back but the question I ask them if you sell your mother and then you get the political power and you get the money to go and buy your mother and your mother is dead. What will you do? I'm by Alaya Nam. I'm Baba Mabadet. Al Badet Dilla. When I'm from Masi, I'm Baba Mabada. At Banyan Namu. Anya Lira. Apaya Namu. Banyama. Alleged Fenem Papa Mawada. At Resilini. At a Tresin Namu. Agapai. Ampia Jigsa. And so when NDC is in office, we do things that will benefit you, benefit your children and your grandchildren. And that is why when NDC is in office, we invest in electrification. We send electricity to communities. We invest in education. We remove schools under trees. We build secondary schools. We invest in hospitals, in healthcare, we invest in roads, we invest in water so that people can get good uh, drinking water to drink. And that benefits not only you, it benefits your generations to yet to come and yet unborn. Awa Ta NDC Terantanam Ajanamupo Tinya Polka Tinanti Nyadi Atukuma Man Rubika Mena Data Ale tu poba ale tu dorden yini de la bolusa te NDC anan sonam ta jare sina abasu bolma pana ku ngamena ase skuba anya tilenti nyadi atrubika mena anya fasia onye boka azun chonga but what do the other people do what do the other people do they make you sweet promises that they don't intend to fulfill one village, one dam. One district, one factory. One million dollars per constituency per year. We'll do this, we'll do that. We'll give you f uh, phones and you pay one one CD a month. We'll do, uh, I mean, just promises. Ang Yakudema Banyan Tap and Pass Maja Baran Jamba Jam Pulini Nambat Badesaba Amba Baranye. Bayem balete balete kodi amena mori ang kuzitu nsi mena bate felka linga one million dollars ang ten mena district mena balise factory ang danga de bangwa yekma ang balete ni phones ba atina tuni a one city a two city amakula mena ba poina po ba sebukuma ang kaventa and so elections have consequences. If you make a wrong choice, you have to live with it for four years. What our young people want today is not phones and pay one city, one city. Our young people want jobs because if they get jobs, 
they can buy their own phones. And where the Nati got on Benilla, Beer Tonkamena, Anyanta Kuliba, Beer Tonkame, Ferencanton Marcia, Felenia, Kunanang, Dilla Bulusa, Atitara and Jam, Tinyanton Nalini, Tanya Yaka Tilenti Yedi to Kumawa Mena, Tila Tinyatila, Ale Tinyaku Kerry, Setebat Bimba and Paloco, Anya Trima, Trim Mansa, Atom. That have been in the table phone, the battle now one city, a two city, table dreamer at the bottom, but I'm not doing my satom, but I'm not doing my satom, but I'm not And so, even though NDC is known as the nation builder because of our track record in infrastructure. We are not only going to do infrastructure. When we come, we'll continue the things that you, you need. I know that the road from, from BC to Kanjaga to Koninga has to be done. I know the road from Kumbisi to URC has to be done. I know the road from Sandema through from BC to VAC to WA has to be done. We know all those things should be done. I know that... I know that... You need a tertiary educational institution here because the whole of this area, there's no tertiary educational institution. I know you need that. And was ever come out to work at Mena was ever come out. What was ever come out? I NDC. I end on Jambo Parumpo. Ta Gomes Katanka. Atika Yiri. Gomes Yirika. Ta Kwasina. As a school bar. As a hospital bar. At the light, at the quadro now, Kumapo Ama Dakulanini was a Kuma Avranya Takla Glabu Kuyanika de Mena to the second school, Bakuma Ama Tika School Kuyama to buy you and Tashala Kula Mena was a Kuma now on Parmeni, Waranjamo, Waliton Tene. So we'll do all that for you. But in the next coming of NDC, our priority is jobs, jobs, and jobs. Angamena to Chila, Naran Jitawa at all day, Tunga Gumopo, Waranja Waluton Tene, Ama Waluman Chila, Wati, Alipodich and Kwang Kwangale, Trima, Trima, Trima. And so. We know the potential of Bulsa South when it comes to food production. And so we're going to help the farmers by setting up a, a farmer service center. We're going to bring tractors, we're going to bring combined harvesters, we're going to bring plows, planters, fertilizer, we decide everything the farmers need. <laughs> Dela nyingla waranjamo wonwo jankuma ti bajanla farmer service center kulan ku tinka center kui ate kongu ta tractor ba ata combine ba ata fertilizer ata ngamba mena ate parma ayala table ku yenin kade and we are going to establish rice processing factory here in Bursa South so that when our farmers farm the rice we will give them a minimum oh please we'll give them a minimum guaranteed price so that they don't lose because when the middlemen come to buy you don't need to put that one on it's loud enough when the middlemen come to buy they buy at a low price, but we'll give a minimum guaranteed price so that the farmers don't lose. So when they get all these services from the service center, they will go and sell their rice and then they go back and pay the cost of the inputs. But the rice milling plant will buy the rice and it will process it for the farmers. If you can market it yourself, you go and market it. I don't know what name we'll call it. Maybe you call it Fumbisi Special Rice. Every Fumbisi rice farmer will go and mill his rice, will put it in the same bag, 
from BC a pack special rice. <laughs> And then you know what we'll do? Government will buy all that rice. And we will give the rice to our secondary schools to feed our children. We'll give the rice to our hospitals to feed our patients. We'll give the rice to our prisons to feed our prisoners. So that our, our farmers can get a market. And what I'm saying? We want to lock up the pion. At the Muma. Dang and bat the womba set. I'll give an pond in Lala. Jacquion part with it. I'll an Yaku for Seba. Ah, yes, set our factory. At the bar, I'll come with a la. Baran qua. But I can look in it to be a fee. At Badang comes Nanan Nalini. Then a bow. Now such as a po. At the Bangmars in a zoo. From BC, aromatic special rice. Yasidi from BC. A pack aromatic special rice. Ate mwenye te bamba firi la baran firi government wa aleda aya pa mwenye la a charity to school ma ati bisha daga de ala gua kumula banya ngadi cha ati achak nenarisa towa. Ezu. We're also introducing the 24-hour economic policy so that businesses can work longer hours and employ more of our young people. And we, while you know, while I want you to at a bamba, maribumba, paloko, atukula, abat, atat, gerum, ajam. And to have the 24-hour economic policy, we need safety and security. It means that. We need more police officers, we need more prison officers, we need more fire officers, immigration, customs. We estimate that we have to recruit at least 25,000 police officers. And we want to give all of you the opportunity. So we are not going to hide in secret and write names. We will come region by region so that all of you can get an opportunity if you want to work for the security services. At the 24 hour economy, what I'm la, but I'm asking my, I'm way, but Panuva, I'm busy. At the back, I'm police. I'm a soldier. By me, I'm a security service. I'm at the normal line. I'm a gangula. I'm a gangula. I'm a pussy. I'm a down. I'm a camera. I'm a jigger. Dilla nyingla. Koko yila. I'm way. Well, the Panuva, I pay. I see 2,500 la. Well, our pala, we can pay. I see the normal. Yango dema liborum mare. I pala. We are tell you. At the back, me na alborola. I bag na you. And for the government workers or anybody who has formal employment, we are introducing a housing program for you. So if you are working and you have an income and you have at least 15 to 20 years of your working life left, we will give you the design of a house. It will be in cities, not in dollars. You show where you want the house to be built. The house will be built and we will deduct from your salary month by month by month for 15 years, 20 years until you finish paying for it. Awe, tabai, zimale masa, adeta tuima, abongo mendo pa tomela, adviden ta tomga bena, abapi alenganula, balinyu kukere, adbata wadi ajama di ye sekala, balinye adbase yeni, adviden ya danudi fela yari dila, adbaga sefede la ya juju la, adviya tuma mama. Fe bena piga alga nuaptamu aga pala albo tunuya atuwa mena abanya jik agua. And so teachers, nurses, doctors, everybody who has a fixed income, you can benefit from this housing program. You can either build it in your hometown or you can build it where you are working so that you don't have to pay rent. And this will be available to all those who have working life of about 15 to 20 years left. You will pay in CDs, not in dollars. And you pay at a low interest rate, not at a high interest rate. I want you to get it. At the buy, the buy is in Karachiba, Nairobi, Dota, ba. At the two matam, at the empathy, alenga nu, at the pa pisiela, the obak amanya yende chwa. For two months, don't get jinia. For ten kai, at the finiela, at the wunye, at the kama matuni, do wunyenga. Wawa wunyenga ma, at the tunga de, baba wunyenga ma, at the kama mutsuzure, lugilinga, akanzure. 
atbaamina alayala abanya kubuza kuchinga siri kuda dola finally there are those who don't do anything they won't build anything don't do electricity nothing and then they wait when it's election time they come and give you 500 cities they say bring your momo number so that we'll send you money when they ask for your momo number give it to them when they bring you 500 cities collect it when they send you momo the alert comes take the money and do whatever you want with it because it is your money they've made a lot of money so they'll come with it when they come do like i said north don't refuse i said north they went and were distributing 200 cities 200 cities to everybody the people took the money and what did they do they voted for the truth and so on the 7th december when they bring the money take the money but when you go to vote remember the hardship remember the hunger that you have gone through for eight years and vote for the truth And so finally, I am standing for the presidential election. My name is John Dramani Mahama. And my brother here is the one standing on behalf of NDC uh, in the parliamentary elections. And you know his doctor, Clement Abasina Apak. And what has done, President? December 7th, the vote is Why? At what party NDC? In a many years, I was in Parliament. Ale na de bika na de shoku na de choro na de nonko. Doctor Clement Abasina Apak Middle na. And we need a healthy majority in Parliament to be able to do the things that we have said we'll do for you. And so when you vote for me, you must also vote for Dr. Clement Apak. And so when you vote for JM, you must also vote for Apak. Apak, Make, Mape. Apak, Mape. Apak, Mape. Mahama. Mape. Apak. Mape. Mahama. Mape. Thank you very much. I want you to be JM. But, but Yesterday I was in Navrongo. I was in Jenga Navarong with my Casina brothers. Ale wo bancha lo yoba lo swata de bachin yulisa. And when I was leaving, they gave me a bag of granuts. I was at Chenla, but they were casting palm burning. I've come to my Bursa brothers, and you haven't given me your granuts yet. I was at Jang wo bancha o mama bulukula na dente wo sing palm burning kayo. 